Holidays can be a difficult time for victims of gun violence and their families. Tonight, as we continue to search for solutions to the violence, our Ashley King shows us how a pastor is not only blessing families, but also calling on the community to get involved. As Christmas approaches, the Healing Waters Outreach Center is spreading the holiday spirit of giving. If you really think about Christmas, it's not just about receiving, it's also about giving and being grateful for what you got. Tylena Thomas is a volunteer here. She's sorting through an estimated $500,000 worth of donated items, everything from kayaks to bikes, thermos, and blankets. These things were either donated by the community or given to Healing Waters through Walmart's Good 360 program. For here, it is about feeding the hungry, clothing the naked, taking care of widows and children. Robert Holt is the pastor here. Earlier this month, he opened the doors for Central Arkansans to come in and use fake money to buy any of these things. And right now, Healing Waters and other organizations are joining together to also collect toys for kids at the Whetstone Boys and Girls Club and the Methodist Children's Home. And a lot of these items will be used for families that are in need. And while it warms Holt's heart to know they will be blessing families, he can't help but think about the family of the five-year-old who was shot about two weeks ago in Little Rock. I wish that I could give that child that opportunity of not being shot. I wish there was something that I or my family could have done to keep that child from being shot. He's now calling on the community to step up. It's time for each and every one of us to reach our neighbor. Don't worry about reaching the world. Let's just reach our neighbor. And therefore, we might be able to stop some of this senseless violence that's going on, especially right here before Christmas. A reminder that together we can make a difference. In Shannon Hills, I'm Ashley.